Okay, so like starting out immediately blink to the gens. I mean, probably the gens that are farthest from you. But you really don't want to waste any time. Like with me, I tend to be AFK a lot. There's I thought I saw somebody running. Um there is progress on that, so somebody is there. So, like here, right? Nurse is slow, so you can't really, like, walk around expecting to catch somebody. You literally have to blink and turn your cameras, like, uh, work, like move your camera around while you're mid-blink in order to catch a glimpse. She run this way. And then follow scratch marks. Sound is important. Let's see, I just guess now I'm not going to use my second blink. I'm trying to always keep two blinks. So the first blink will go 20 meters. See, I see scratch marks, right? So... I don't know, I think she's just creeping around rocks and stuff, like being stealthy. But either way, you don't want to spend too much time... Um, like trying to just chase one person that you can't even find. See, I have no aura reading, so I'm just trying to find them. It's a slow start. Sometimes you find people pretty quickly. But, you know, scratch marks. So I'm going to use this for distance, for travel. I'm not going to use my blink because I'm still too far. So I'm getting my second blink back. And they're here, right? So now I'm close enough that I can actually attack. She ran back this way. So the rocks will break line of sight. They already did two gens. So I have to do something like this. So what I did there was I aimed my blink this way, and then I flicked to this side and got her here to surprise her because she saw me aiming my blink that way. That was insane. But gens are going too fast, honestly. So... <clears throat> now what I want to do is, like, try to look for 3 gen, which is kind of, like, here. Let me just make sure nothing's on this. There is somebody behind that rock. I'm gonna act like I don't see them. I wish I got teammates that did gens. I know, right? So... As when they when they do that when they drop like that they're locked in an animation so it's like a guaranteed hit if you blink right they're just gonna give up so he dropped a flashbang I just looked the other way like that's really gonna work right the only time that works on me is if they turn a corner and I don't know that they dropped the flashbang. If I don't hear it, I don't see him drop it. See, since he unhooked her there, I'm just gonna bring this one right back to this hook. So, see, they're playing like potatoes when it comes to, like, um, chasing. But they are rushing gens. Like, they understand the importance of doing gens. So we're somewhere in that, like, medium MMR, I guess, where people understand the objective. But they're not pro loopers. Or they're probably they might be better with M1 killers, but they probably just don't have a lot of experience against a nurse. Because nobody's doing anything that's like what really good survivors would be doing, which is constantly changing their directions. So, since I see scratch marks in this way, I'm going to do a long blink in this direction. And now I get a glimpse of her this way, like looking at the scratch marks. So, another long blink in that direction. I'm still not going to use my second blink. I'm trying to get closer. And so, when, you, when you're here, you want to turn your camera. So, like, let's say when you blink across these, you don't want to just blink across them like this. Because the survivor could be anywhere. You actually want to turn your camera so you're facing this way. 
So if she's here, and I blink right here with the first blink, she can either run to the left or run to the right or vault this or continue to run that way. So based on what she does, I use the second blink as a reaction. So if I, I go like this and she vaults back, I catch her here. So, but, but I need two blinks for that. So if I go here and she continues this way, I still get her here. Like it, the second blink is a reaction. The first one is positioning. She probably wonders like what I'm doing right now. <laughs> this, I'm doing this. They didn't want to save you, I'm sorry. Jen's before friends. Yeah, I wasted a lot of time, though. Please bring Deadlock as your only perk. Just buy that extra little bit of time. So, so if she didn't throw that, what I was going to say at these pallets, so she locks herself in the animation when she vaults that. So you don't even want to try to play pallets against the nurse. You're better off. Like, you can throw the pallet, but do it only if you have distance. If the nurse is kind of far from you, then throw it and keep running, probably. Just so it puts a barrier between you. But, like, really, in most cases, you don't even want to throw the pallet. Or vault a window. Hello. <laughs> See, I just followed the scratch marks. See, and there, what I did there was, I didn't, like, I'm tempted after I do my first blink to immediately charge my second blink because there's only a small window that you have to, to blink the second time. But sometimes you actually don't want to. You just want to do the first blink and wait. And the survivors, Will sometimes run right into you but the problem is if you if you do charge your second blink now you can't swing so if they run back into you you're forced to like take the stun and you can't swing while you're charging so there's this little grace period in between the first and second blink and sometimes you actually just want to like allow that allow for that time to wait and you could even sometimes do a fast enough reaction like like that. Like, I still waited, but supposing I saw somebody quick enough, I could still have, like, a really small window to get the blink. The second blink is, is a lot harder to get, because if you don't do it in time, then you go into the fatigue. See, once again, they're gonna, they're gonna get the last gen done, probably. Somebody's over here, somewhere. That time, that time I used my second blink just to get over here quicker. Because if anybody's around, I want to scare them off the gen. But usually you want to reserve your second blink. Man, this split is really bad. Not here, though. That's good. So, you know, you, it's good to try to take high ground. I, I meant to try to get up there, but it, I aimed it wrong. See, I, I almost, I didn't time that right, that second blink. So, I just walk her down at this point. Does nurse not have terror radius? Um, she does, but right now you see the black smoke on the side of the screen and the little, on the right, the little, like, uh, insidious looking emblem. I'm undetectable at the moment because of the add-on when I get a, a blink hit. 
I think it's like 16 seconds of undetectable. I feel like they're on this gen. They've got to be on this gen, yeah. Oh, I see. All right, so there's one here and one there. The other's on hook. So what I have to do is play to try to intercept the hook rescue. Maybe I'm not seeing... I thought I saw someone down there. He's trying to link... He's just trying to, like, hang out and get back on that jet. So what you don't really want to do against good survivor... He dropped another one, so I looked the other way. What you don't really want to do against really good survivors is try to um, cut them off with a blink. Like, you see them running in a direction and then you uh, try to blink in front of them because a good survivor will double back. So safe blinking is more like blinking behind them a little bit. In a position where if I'm behind her, right, then I can react. See, the rock just... Actually, it's probably the pallet and the rocks combined, but... Bacon the hitboxes. Yeah, I'm trying to give her the save. So if I blink more behind her, and then see what she does, rather than trying to cut her off, you know? Like, trying to cut her off like a sniper would be like, Oh, I see her running that way. See, she's waiting on me. So I see her running that way, and I go like this, and then all of a sudden, she double backs or goes another direction. So it's better to actually blink, like, in a tail range. Because then she goes this way, and I reacted to it. You know, but had I, had I blinked farther, like, right on her, and she turned this way... You know, she might have got more distance. Dude, this is like a nurse master class. Alright, so let's say behind him, like he's got a tail right here. Perfect. And I didn't use my second blink, but that was the perfect range to put your first blink, basically. So you want to put it, like, kind of right behind him. So even if I need to react with the second one, it's all a matter of where you place the first one, you know? Because let's say I saw him running for that pallet, and I decided to, oh, I'm going to cut him off on this side of the pallet. But when I blink here, he doesn't vault the pallet. He double backs and runs the other way, you know? Who, who uh, quit? This guy? He quit. Well, Twitter gets a throat massage. He didn't want to be a willing participant in the master class. She's rubbing her butt all over him. I think for that she can live, right? Well, I think for that she can live. She rubbed her butt on the Rage Quitter's head. I like it. Fine. That's only fair skeptical smiley face. Skeptical smiley face. Meg, it's okay. I'm not gonna hurt you. Just gonna shut the hatch in your face and play the trust game. Actually, I don't want her going out the gate because that might hurt my MMR. So we'll just let her get the hatch. So do I have? Oh, I have bad man's last breath. She's just going to try to work the gen. So, 
turning or spinning while blinking like it can be for style points but it is it also can be practical so if you're like trying to search the tile for survivors you know assuming your eyesight can catch it you know you can and you go in at the right angle you can search inside areas Why did I feel like I heard her, but she probably went to this gate. Where's the hatch? The tile, uh, just meaning like this, uh, these are called tiles, like, like these areas that are loop, that are uh, for looping, you know, like this area is a tile. This one. Is it true the nurse's second blinks are shorter than the first? Distance wise. Yes, the first blink is 20 meters, I believe, and the second one will only go 12 at max range, too. So, like. that. Yeah, it's shorter. So, it's harder to actually master the timing of the second blink to get max range. Because you have a very small window to, to get it. But. That's the other thing is like playing with nurses like it takes patience to where you're tempted. You're always tempted to blink the second time immediately. So you you feel like you're going to like you're going to catch them with your second blink. But really, you want to make sure that you don't use that second blink unless you know blood points. Unless you know that you're going to get the hit, or at least you know you're close enough that it's a, maybe not a guarantee, but like really likely that you're going to get the hit. Otherwise you would save your blink and just eat the fatigue. And then you also don't want to swing unless you know you're going to get the hit. Because if you, tacos by not spending them. for yeah. every, for every blink, every additional blink you do, you have a longer fatigue and every missed swing will add on another second so if you just spend your blinks and swing and miss the survivors will get so much distance on you so it's it's also hey, like it a Tula. patience game too it's like waiting for the right moment like setting yourself up and waiting for that moment but also being good enough that you can put yourself in that position rather quickly to get a hit I, you are right. It is. You I was, can also get yourself above the cap. I was thinking about making an actual course that went into like a lot of detail with with all this stuff and gave the different scenarios. But in order to do that, it'd be pretty time consuming, and I would need like someone to go into custom games with me and act out the scenarios to actually demonstrate them. And then I just, and then I just don't know if enough people would care to watch a video like that. There are nurse guides out there, but most of them are just very like basic and they just give you the overall, oh, do this, do this, do this. But like, I'm talking about making one that goes in real in, in depth in all those, in all those different scenarios about like the windows and the pallets and the trees and what survivors do and how, what you should expect and all those things. Like another thing is if you're catching a survivor at a pallet and you're blinking to it. I absolutely love watching your nurse games because you talk us through everything. Thanks. I, I, a, a lot of times, word is Maury. a lot of times I'm quiet playing nurse and just chilling, but if people are asking and they want to know, then I'll explain it. But <laughs> for instance, like at a pallet, if I'm, if a survivor's running to a pallet towards a pallet and I, I know I can blink there at the same time, if I do a full lunge swing by holding down the mouse button, there's a good chance they're going to get the animation of the stun with the pallet. But if I just do a quick swing, that's not like a lunge where you just tap the mouse button, you do a faster swing. It's a shorter swing, a yeah. new follower is but yeah. kingdom. It doesn't lunge, but if you catch them at the pallet with that, even if they hit you with the pallet, you're still going to hit them with that short swing because it's just too fast. 
in the never ending race for the title of so it's like for me i get hit with a lot of pallets as a nurse and people are like oh i hit the nurse with a pallet i'm just like i don't even care if i get hit with a pallet because i'm just like one blink away so it's like i just don't respect pallets Deadlock. Oh. Why would we do that? How about how about corrupt too? For the title of viewer with the fastest opposable thumbs. Keep smashing those likes to steal the lead for a brief moment before another robs you of it. What about corrupt? Is that going overboard? What about agitation? They get to hooks faster. What about some meme stuff that is totally useless? I got my first spirit pallet stun while she was phasing and I was super happy about that lol. Yeah, it's harder to stun a nurse. It is. But for me, it's like I stun myself because I just blink right to the pallet and I don't even care because I'm probably going to... I'm likely going to get the hit and if I don't get the hit, I'm going to get it like within the next five seconds. But it is harder to stun a nurse. What's what's something? Should I put Should I put perks or no? Might as well throw in pain res or pop at that point. I mean, the gens really going that fast? with the fastest opposable thumbs keep smashing those likes to steal the lead for a brief moment before another robs you of it or or should we use um like nowhere to hide tacos takes the maybe not pain the res maybe like pop because if we're going to be kicking gems thumbs. Keep smashing those likes to steal the lead for a brief moment before and another robs you of it. Tacos takes the lead in the never-ending race for the title of viewer with the fastest opposable thumbs. Keep smashing those likes to steal the lead for a brief moment before another robs you of it. Man, I never got my coffee. We never switched to Survivor. We didn't try Chogs. Tacos takes the lead in the never-ending race for the title of viewer with the fastest opposable thumbs. Keep smashing those likes to steal the lead for a brief moment before another robs you of it. Tacos takes the lead in the never-ending race for the title of viewer with the fastest opposable thumbs. Keep smashing those likes to steal the lead for it's a brief okay, moment before another robs think. you of it. Tacos takes the lead in the never-ending race for the title of viewer with the fastest opposable thumbs. Keep smashing those likes to steal the lead for a brief moment before another robs you of it. Tacos takes the lead in the never ending race for the title of viewer with the fastest opposable thumbs. Keep smashing those likes to steal the before another robs you of it. A new follower has joined the kingdom. the lead in the never-ending race for the title of viewer with the fastest opposable thumbs. Keep smashing those likes to steal the lead for a brief moment before another robs you of it. Tacos takes the lead in the never-ending race for the title of viewer with the fastest opposable thumbs. Keep smashing those likes to steal the lead for a brief moment before another robs you of it. This is just sad. Tacos takes the lead in the never-ending race this for the title of viewer with the fastest opposable thumbs. Keep smashing those likes to steal the lead for a brief moment before another robs you of it. Takes the lead in the never-ending race for the title of viewer with the fastest opposable thumbs. So we wasted time, but we have corrupt, so... Whatevs. See, I don't know why they don't pre-run off the gens there. Like, 
They don't hear the tire radius and say, hey, time to go. No, they just play like Big Show. They sit on the jet. Oh, she wants? What is this? Maybe she thinks I'm a baby nurse? Oh, we got a big shot. Look, look, we're doing baby nurse things. We're vaulting. We're bloodlusting. Oh, she is juicing. We'll do some bad blinks and whiffs just to like make her think that we're that we're just a baby. Okay, we miss on purpose. And then we'll do we'll like break Oh, she's trying to be silly and friendly or or what? Alright, you know what? We're gonna leave her alone for now. Like she just defeated us. We'll go for someone else. See, okay, so well. Alright, so he's out in the open. Out in the open is like all you could ever ask for. More than you could ever ask for. If they're in the open. Like, there's really nothing you can do if you're in the open that nurses close range. She's coming in for a flashlight save. No, stop it. Stop shining the light in my face. It's a never-ending race, but thank you for less than three. Alright, so now since I'm a noob, like I'm gonna I'm gonna tunnel him. I'm gonna tunnel him like a noob. Watch, she's gonna pop up. Oh, okay, I thought, I thought she was gonna try to get a flashlight see. She is though. Let's, let's let her get it. Oh, look at that! Wow, she's awesome. We're still gonna tunnel him though. We're still tunneling. And she's chasing me. Alright, so. So you wanna blink, like I said, behind him? Locker. Oh, he got me. I go this way. Oh, you didn't get it that time. Guys, look, I am cooking this nurse right now. Do the gems. <laughs> Watch, it's gonna backfire though. They are gonna do the gems and all get out and teabag me. What is she thinking though? Like, is she fooling around? All right, now we'll we'll take some hooks. All that free gen time. Look at this. Nowhere to hide. Hello. Oh, wait a minute. Why is he on second hook? Here, shine the spotlight on this. Shine the spotlight on this. There you go. I don't know what's so funny, Kate. You're next. See, all right, so she actually did juke me there. Really good timing. I wasn't expecting a double back. So, okay, so we're on this truck here. 
So we do the same thing with the rock. Except for I shouldn't have swung with my with my first blink there. I should have used my second blink. So like let me try to explain it. All right, she's here. I'm gonna put my first blink here and then use my second blink. But she's she is actually juking really well. Like I'm not I'm not really expecting this from these survivors. But at tacos it's not. You just need good decision making while tunneling. I mean it's not a bad strat, it's actually a really good strat. But I really wasn't I really wasn't trying to tunnel him to kill him. I was just doing it to to make it look like I was afraid of chasing the Kate because she's she was juicing me, you know. I was trying to pretend like I was a baby nurse to get her confidence up. She clicked the flashlight a little bit and I wanted her to be more like clicky with it and The thing is I don't wanna feel bad. I don't want to feel bad about killing them. And if I can get them to, to act cocky. Some people will loop you for five gens lol. I just don't know cause it's the added pressure of them being close to death, but, but if it's bad. No, survivors will cry and you know they'll say it goes against the imaginary entitled survivors. Well so it would be like the entitled survivor's imaginary rule book. Okay. Well, where's Ada? Is there an Ada on the team? Tell me she's cranking out another gen. You see what I'm saying? They're 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 all about getting the gens done, but where's the the altruism. She's dead. Kate's dead. Where's the teamwork? I didn't even get to strangle Kate. I wanted to choke her. There's Ada in the room with us right now. Okay, so at least... Look, we're gonna get nowhere to hide, maybe. Look around, look around. Oh, what have we found? Bad blink. See, my blinks... You know what it is, is that... All this, the hitboxes, and then the survivor's hitboxes. And I couldn't land anywhere over here because this rock was here. This rock, this tree. It wasn't letting me blink. I would have to place the blink perfectly, like, right here. Because she was over here. I didn't realize... I didn't realize that that rock... Was like that. Camping hooks are so stupid. Well, you don't want to camp a hook... Right at a hook. You want to, like... What you call proxy camp? Meaning... Ideally, right? a hook if doors open seems fine. Ideally, there's a there's a gen there, there's a gen there, there's a gen here, right? Right, she's dead. But if you look at it, there's a camp is camping from afar. Well, in this case, you have a generator here, you have a generator here, and you have a generator down there. So the best thing would be for me to put someone on this hook, and I could literally watch the hook, that gen, this gen. And that gen. And I could be far enough that I could like watch all of it if I had someone on that hook right there. So those are the situations you want to put yourself in where you're not necessarily camping someone in their face while people are doing gens. This Ada's never even been hooked. Window. I could tell she was gonna go for that window. Like she wasn't looking back or anything. I think she was just hiding. I think she was the one doing all the gems. What about when they've opened the door and there's three alive? 
<laughs> Go get your tea bags, I guess. She had crows above her head. Really? Now you can camp. Now you can camp them right in their face. What are these tea bags for? for the extra hooks, right? Haha, she is helping you RN. Nah, they just, they gave up. But I don't feel like waiting for two gens. Ada's lucky day. And nurse girls night out. Real. Trust came. Close it in her face. Or let her go. Close it in her face or let her go. Let her go or close it in her face. Close it in her face. More you're on the hatch. Let her go. Close it. Close, close. it in her face. Close. Ha 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 ha. Close. Close. At check out the wild night Ada, Meg, and Michaela had on the YT channel. It's even crazier. Mori. Mori. Great. Guys are so mean. Toxic nurse off. No. After what happened to Rebecca, I think we gotta let it go. We gotta let it go. We've been toxic enough. Can't be oh, tell me she's gonna run the other. Wow, she's gonna run the other way. See, they don't. They don't trust. Where's the trust? This is U E M B R A S E, the dark side. This is you embrace the dark side. So, so cool. Watch her dead hard right through a hit. She's trying to heal herself. by exit. She's trying to heal herself. Yeah. Followers join yeah. the kingdom. We'll give her, we'll do the trust Mori. test. The trust test. If she can make it back to the gate, if she doesn't try to outsmart, if she just runs straight. I'd be so mad. Trust test. Trust test! Oh. Snap. That's dirty. 
You guys are so mean. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let her out. You guys are so cruel. That's for being AFK. No, they say this specifically needed the trust test. Nice. She was AFK. She deserves the Mori. Uh, honestly, I can empathize with that. I'm AFK a lot. That's like my one pet peeve. Real. It's killers attacking AFK players. Although I, she must have been AFK like most of the match maybe she went I, she, I think she was doing gens i think maybe she hid in a locker and got crows yeah, or Prophet, something every time i play with you you're afk can you talk about how you got the blood points that high um blood points are capped at two million but you can go over them if you don't spend them so the only way you can actually get more is if you put in like a one of those codes in the store that give you blood points or when the rank reset happens, like, let's just say, hypothetically, you got to red rank one on both killer and both survivor. No. If I was on my cheating account, I would have 999,999,999 blood points and iridescent shards and auric cells. I just don't spend the blood points. So if you get to red rank one, on killer you'll get a million blood points when the rank resets and same thing for survivor so supposing you got to red rank one on both killer and survivor you get two million blood points if i got those two million blood points added they would actually accumulate on top of this because they were given by behavior for the rank reset but at this point like i won't get any of these blood points the in the game e 100 nurse how does the server not detect 999 million 999,999 of everything in instant venue? I don't have the answer for that. I mean, should we go play cheese games or are you guys enjoying the sweaty killer games? They're so sweaty. And tacos because this account does not have that many. It's only 4 mil. Wait, Prophet, didn't you get banned on the P100 Nurse YT account? How's all that not server site? Do a zero blink game. What? You can't with Nurse. Survivors are faster than Nurse. You literally have to blink unless you're bringing a build that makes you walk faster. You can't catch them without blinking. So. Do a sweat perk game. Trust. I want to see how effortless it can be. Don't nurse have an add-on to make her faster? With what? Blanking? I'm bad at blank. I just explained how I got 4 million. It's actually closer to 5. <laughs> what about all aura reading? Do your sweatiest perk build. I want to see the fastest nurse game ever. Well, it depends if they hide and all that. Look, there's three TTVs right here. Want anyone want to see if they're live? At a Xavier LZ TLDR, do not spend BP and earn more. There's four TTVs here. Unless they're fake TTVs. Last video two years ago, LMAO. I don't know. I'm not really finding much.
None of them look like they're alive. I am the type to dodge when there's that many TTVS lol. None of them are alive? Okay. I don't dodge TTVs. I give them throat massages. 